Hey folks, many of you know that I've been running uh, Schwalbe tires for my race bike in the last couple of years. You see here the Thunderbird in the back, which is my preferred option. And up front, I really fell in love with the Rocket Run last year. But uh, for 2019, looks like uh, Schwalbe has something else in store for us. I am talking about this set, Racing Roth in the back, the new design and Racing Ray up front, so why don't we take a closer look. I have both the 29er and the 27.5 version of these tires. These two are 29er uh, 225 and they are Evolution Series, Snakeskin Tubeless Ready Compound, Attic Speed Grip for the Racing Ray, the only tire compound that they exist in. The Racing Ralph is Attic Speed, you see the red stripe here. And again, that is the only compound that they exist in. And the only other piece of information that's useful is here, HS489 for Racing Ray and 490 for Racing Ralph. This is how they identify these tires. Only other thing in the box is how to set up their tires tubeless. And here are the tires. Brand new tire, brand new thread for Racing Ralph. These are Evolution Series, tubeless ready, snakeskin sidewall, so this is a reinforced sidewall and both tires are built to be 625 grams. You can see the Racing Ralph 29er is 616 grams, so 10 grams less than the spec and the Ray is 596, so this is 20 grams less than what's on the spec, which is unusual. My experience with the previous Attics compound tires was that they were all overweight. This is the 650B tire racing ray. This is supposed to be 590 grams and it's 549. So this is huge drop, about 40 grams under. And racing routes 27.5. This is 598 and it was supposed to be 590. I'm installing the tires on a set of Stance Arch MK3 rims that I have reviewed not too long ago. They provide a 26 millimeter ID or internal dimension and this redesign profile has 16 millimeter height. Getting the tires on the rim was the usual business, a bit tight. You can see the rotation here for the directional thread. Also the relevant information for the tire, again these are 29er 225s. Aside from that, the only thing I noticed was that this uh, snakeskin sidewall seemed to be a bit more textured than in the past. And just like there are the tires, these are made in Indonesia and you can see the HS489 product code for the racing ray. Side to side wobble, it's a lot better than what I've seen on the Schwalbe tires as of late. Also if you look at the thread here, nice and round and there's no channels whatsoever. It looks as if you're just riding on a solid block of rubber. Also on this side view you can see the cornering knobs here sticking out of the casing but just slightly so. This is the Racing Ralph. Racing Ray casing is as good but in this case you can see the pattern, you can see the channels here that should give you better cornering grip with this being a dedicated front tire design. I've had both tires at 35 PSI for a couple of days and you can see here casing to casing it's 56 millimeters stated on their website is 57 millimeters and that is 2.21 inches and the new Racing Ralph is at 227 so very close to the 225 that is supposed to be that is almost 58 millimeters height for both tires to the center knobs it's about 69.5 5 millimeters. That's with a 16 millimeter rim height as mentioned earlier. Cornering knob height is identical on the two tires. It's at around 4.5 millimeters. However, when you get here to the rolling knobs of the two tires, you're going to find something like 2.6 millimeters here on the Racing Ray, 2.4 on the Racing Ralph. Also, overall, the Racing Ray, which is the Speed Grip compound, seem to be slightly smaller tire than this uh, Speed or the Red Strip uh, Racing Ralph. Good volume tires for these 225s. Interesting to have dedicated thread pattern front and rear. 
they are true to their weight also casing seems to be well done so definitely she will be up their game for 2019 what about you folks do you plan to use any of the new Schwalbe tires for racing in 2019 I would love to hear your comments if you have any questions for me let me know below if you like this don't forget to like and subscribe and until next time I will see you guys on the trails cheers guys cheers